if you want to develop the wooden dummy, what you need to do, you know, what you need to study first before the dummy. Can you start the wooden dummy training without doing any form? Why? I see the movie, so excited, I want to do it. Huh? Yeah. Need a structure. No structure. Why? No structure. So if someone doesn't know what a dummy, if you train a dummy, what will happen? What will happen? You can hurt yourself. Huh? You can hurt yourself. Hurt yourself. Yeah, one thing. You can hurt yourself. Correct. Positioning. Positioning wrong. Energy wrong. And you will hit the dummy as hard as you, you can. You think harder you... You, dab, you, 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 you hit the dummy, better you get. Why do, why do you need a dummy if you want to hit a wood? Put a piece of wood, go. That, that tree there, hit every day. See any stick and you break it. Yeah. No. A dummy is a, like a person who train wood, not hitting it. You know, learn, learn the angles. So, but I want to be powerful. Be powerful, don't start the wrong channel. You want an arm, iron arm, don't start the Wing Chun because you lost the sensitivity. Let's say you, you create and you make a metal forearm seal, like an Iron Man too. So anything you touch, it breaks. You know, is it Wing Chun? It's not Wing Chun. So some people, is, you know, they train with them and say, I'm so powerful. Myself, I break the four arms. No, I'm changing, I replace the fourth arms. So I already break four, three of those. That's a fourth. They think that's good. You don't need to, if you look, you know, uh, you know iron shield, forearm, or iron arm, you hit everything touch, it hurts. But that doesn't help Wing Chun. You don't need to debug that. I can defend, I can, I can, I can defeat someone with iron arm. Because I don't need to heat, you know, heat with that. It's an angle. That's why you have three arms or two arms, two arms or two legs, or three arms, one leg. Is the person when you have no people to train, with, but you also want to develop the footwork. First one, step. Yeah. Turn one foot out. Heels and heels in line. You don't step like that. Okay. That's a little bit of crap. Water. <laughs> Not heels. Not winter. So the heels and heels in line. Because the straight line is fast. Okay. Say, drag. Drag the back foot. Step. You know, you can a big step, but must be quick. Because the most dangerous part is this part. So, this must follow very quickly. And then turn. Hands is up, is up to you. The best is a Wu Zhao or Tan Zhao. Do this straight line. And the second one is changing foot. And back foot, same. This time, you know, it doesn't matter. Your, your foot must be straight. You can have a little angle, but when you finish, the distance is most important. You can have a little bit open, but because you're going forward, it's straight. But if you walk in a little bit angle, that's still going that direction, but not, might not be 100% straight. Like that. The most importantly is the distance of the heels. So that no matter what. Okay? Any question? Okay, you all try.
Sfântului Constanț. Four is my answer. Although we're trying to talk about short distance, but if your football is good, it's very good. You know, even somebody two meters away, it's already there. Yeah. Or when you punch, punch. So step, you know, stepping back makes a lot of difference. It doesn't matter the high kick or fast punch, long punch. Whoop, you change it. Okay, that's about it. That's the structure. Now, the most important part and advanced footwork is render. So you control. Ma means a horse. So this is your horse. You're riding the horse. You you control the horse. You can tell the horse wherever the wherever the horse go and stop. That's best stance. Okay, go. Yeah. Just walk around randomly. Dummy is very important. Yeah. How you walk around the person. Because in Wing Chun training, it's very close. So little angle, it avoid all the power. You, know, you can defend it, and also avoid all the power come to you. Little angle, you get very disadvantage. That's what you train, train for. How to get the angle, how to get the position right. That's a wooden gun. Otherwise, I tell you, hip man will be, you know, my sigong arm will be bruised or damaged. Even your your sigong hip chun also will have a very iron big arms. No, quite skinny. If you have come across uh, Yip Si Gong's arm, it's very, very soft, silky. So, it's not, no wrinkle. You've got too much, a lot of training. You know, sensitivity. You want to develop this line, and um, um, any insect, the, the antenna, the sensitive. Touch a little bit and feel that develop. And then move every angle you move is right. You the very good gravity. That's what we're going to train. Measure the distance. The best is center. Measure the distance. That's the section. Second one, concept. You know, I see all kinds of, you know, dancing. Yeah. 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 